Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you guys something very interesting. A few months ago I did uh, some graphs of peppers. I made a video on that so I'll give you guys a link. The graft did really well but unfortunately I had a mites infestation and they pretty much killed the graft. So recently I did two more graphs onto my chocolate scotch bonnet which you see right here. I took two plants to graft onto here. One of it is the seven pot white which is this guy here. Right there. Well, look what he is today. So <laughs> I chopped the entire tree off. I'm just experimenting. When you top peppers, I also have a video on how to top peppers and when to do it. Don't just throw the top away. I mean there's so much you can do with it. You can try to root it like I did here. And this has been here for a few weeks. And I have a few clones that I've been working on and that's a clone right there. Basically I took a branch off of this tree which is a orange scotch bonnet. It's ripening there. Then I cloned that and there is some fruits on that plant there. So that, that was once a very small branch. Just about the size of these. So anyway, don't just throw the top pieces away. You can use it to clone or you can use them as grafts onto your other pepper plants. So today I want to show you a, two grafts that I've done. This one here is the white devil's tail. And it's, it's already flowering just like the rest of them. See here, this is where I grafted. And as you can see, the graft healed up. And it's now becoming part of the actual tree. And then it started to flower. You see here? Those are the flowers from that graft. So I'm very excited to see if some of these flowers will stick. And then I'll have multiple different types of fruits on the same tree. Because my chocolate scotch bonnet is already fruiting. This is going to be the third harvest of this plant. I harvested 72 fruits the last time and before that I harvested 21. So this time I'm sure I'm going to get a ton more. And I want to see if these would grow along with it. And then the other graph that I did is the white devil's tail. That was also taken from uh, another plant that I topped. And instead of just throwing it away I grafted onto this plant. And it's looking really nice. Check this one out. So there it is right there. As you can see, see the graft? That's where the graft begins. I cut the branch in half and stick the top of the white devil's tail in. And then it healed up and now it's flowering like crazy. That's, those are all of the flowers from that little, little branch. So I'm looking forward to see if these would actually stick around and I'll get white devil's tail, chocolate scotch bonnet, and white seven pot on this one tree. So that's that's my tree there. It's not very tall. It's uh, probably like a little bit over a foot high. But it's producing like crazy. So I'll keep you guys updated and let you see if I actually get fruits for all three different types. And if I do, I'll make another video to show you guys. Alright, that, that's all for now. Thanks for watching.